Get that thumb over there, you know. That's nice. nice. You just played just exactly what that guitar needed. Quentin Quentin King, Paul here at Music Villa. We're in Bozeman, Montana. And um, we are checking out a Taylor 312 CE. Why? We've already done these, right? Yeah. Do you notice anything different about this one? Oh, put me on the spot. Did you Uh, feel anything different? Did I feel anything different? Feels like a shorter scale. It's a skinnier nut width. Okay, so, so we'll edit that. We've part done out. this before, so <laughs> no, you, shorter scale, no, skinnier nut no, width. It, it's just, it's so this is a one and eleven sixteenths, okay. and so with Taylor, all their guitars are always one and three quarter. But remember a while back, a couple weeks ago, we did the one and seven eighths, the larger oh, nut width. Oh yeah, okay, now it makes so sense. So we had also ordered the three twelve CE in a one and eleven sixteenths nut width. So. It just gives people a, a choice. Um, someone comes in with monster hands, they need the one and seven eighths. Most people are just fine with the one and three quarter, which is Taylor's most common on, the, on their US series guitars. And then you, t- you have to custom order the smaller nut width. So mm-hmm. one 11 sixteenths. So it's just a little bit, a little bit skinnier. Yeah, I felt tighter. In my defense, uh, just a couple minutes ago, I was playing the. Uh, so everything right. feels like a short scale right now. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that thing, yeah. But but now that you feel it, now you can probably feel it because you're no, most every Taylor you play is the exact same. That's yeah. a little. It's skinnier. always difficult because I'm I'm very susceptible to the powers of suggestion. So you're like, All do right. you feel it? I'm like, right. yeah, I feel it. But uh, you know, I'm not sure that I would have picked it out straight away. Yeah. If we which, had another Taylor here, you, you which would... Which suggests that, you know, I, for my, you know, again, I'm, I'm on the record as I like bigger necks. Yeah. Or, you know, wider, yeah. wider necks. Yeah. Uh, but just because it's a little bit tighter doesn't mean that yeah. it's going to be a challenge to play. In fact, it, right. in certain styles and circumstances, even with my, you know, average to larger size yeah. hands, this is still very navigable. But I imagine for someone who struggles with uh, yeah. making the reach for certain chord structures, you know, this well, would... And one thing too, Keep I always, nice I always got to tell people this because a lot of people always say, "Oh, I got to have this nut width," and they're, and they're very set on nut width. But it's not always. It's a lot of it is the shape of the neck on the back right. too, which mm-hmm. changes for a lot of people. I've had people say, "Oh, this feels amazing. This is great for me because it's a one and three quarter." And I'm, and I go, "Well, actually, you're wrong. It's a one eleven sixteenths." <laughs> and the reason they liked it was because of the neck feel on the, the back the profile so, yeah of the yeah i mean but I everyone's different it. but everyone's different there's there's the radius there's the nut width there's the neck shape and yeah. all those things um everyone some people whatever you know you're you're pretty good at you, you whatever just, whatever <laughs> you play it and you're fine other people are very particular about the shape of the if i was more professional i probably would be that <laughs> you know that type of but you know i'm thinking about what you're saying and i can certainly uh appreciate that because again i do like wider necks yeah. But if it was a baseball, you know, like a full size depth and yeah. you know, thickness, then it might not be quite as comfortable. Yeah. You know, because I'm typically playing wider necks, but with low profile. Yeah. Style, so I can see with that. And I even like a skinnier, or you know, you go even smaller. I, I like a smaller nut with, with a, with, with a big with a baseball fair, bat. Okay. Yeah, but see, that would make sense because so, then you know. It but it just depends. You. Yeah. Like I said, it depends on what you're doing and what style you're playing. Um, but yeah, we just thought we'd show you this one because it is available through us. Um, we just order them this way on occasion to have a choice. So um, Who doesn't like choices? Yeah. So with Taylor, you can do that. You can do three nut widths so on any of the models on their U.S. stuff. So that's a 312 CE, which is, of course, their concert body shape. Uh, and uh, mahogany back and sides, spruce top. So there it is. Nice. 312, this is kind of like their. Yeah. Their well, go-to. the 314 is like the, you know, this is a little bit smaller body shape. Mm-hmm. Great guitar, though. Um, it's nice to have it in different nut widths. So, yeah. Quentin, you thanks. You bet. We'll move on. Thanks, everyone, for watching.